2014 St. Louis Cardinals are an intriguing spot. Most seasons, they're the darlings of Missouri playoff baseball and dominate the high headlines this year. It's told a different story as that coverage has gone instead to the Kansas City Royals as the Cards continue to fight for their playoff lives. John Lagan getting the start for the Birds tonight against the Dodgers. 5-0 at Bush Stadium. Great at home so far. Top first, 0-0, lacking a jam. Runner on third, one out, but he gets Adrian Gonzalez to pop out. Next batter then forces Matt Kemp to pop out as well. As well, gets out of the jam. One and uh, still scoreless at that point in time. Then bottom of second, trying to come up big. Help out his cause at the plate. No dice. Grounds up to Hanley Ramirez. Score remains 0-0. Zero, zero. But then later, leading off the bottom of the third, is Matt Carpenter, a deep solo shot to put the cards up 1-0. That's his third home run in three NLDS games. It's currently 1-0 still in the fourth inning. And a crazy MLB playoff so far, much like it was a crazy weekend in college football. 11 ranked teams went down, making it a pretty good week for Missouri Tigers football. By not the case this time, as the Tigers have a marquee matchup against the 13th ranked Georgia Bulldogs. This game will provide a big test for the sometimes porous Missouri defense, which has given up just over 149 rushing yards per game as they face off against a UGA run game that averages a shade under, get this, 289 yards per game and spearheading this attack, Heisman Trophy candidate Todd Gurley, who has only rushed for less than 100 yards once this season. That came during a 66-0 win over Troy in which he only carried the ball six times, still averaged over 12 yards a carry. Today at Media Day, players and coaches talked about facing the star Bulldogs running back. I have not seen everybody play in the country, but I can't imagine a back being another back being better than he is. I ain't never played a back like Ty Gurley. I say back when we played against Eddie Lacy a few years ago, but Ty Gurley, he in the, he in the, he in the zone on, on his own. He on a different level. God didn't make too many people like that, so he's kind of a special guy. And looking on forward beyond the upcoming Georgia game, the SEC announced today the official time for the Tigers game against the Florida Gators. Mizzou will travel down to Gainesville on October 18th. Kickoff at 6 o'clock p.m. That game will be on either ESPN or ESPN2. Heading over to the capital city now for a high school matchup. Softball matchup between Jeff City and Elias. Rival schools face off one last time before district playoffs. Top of the first, Elias Haley Kemper. Two-run home run to left field. Elias takes an early 2-0 lead. Deep shot there for Kemper, but then... Big play of the night comes on Jefferson City side. Bottom of the third, senior Darby Brundage. Grand slam over the wall. You don't see that too many times anywhere. Lady Jays up 5-2. Jefferson City able to hold off Elias Catholic and win 8-4. Lady Jays begin district playoffs on Thursday. That's it for sports.